to reach the desert, we need to pass through a checkpoint northeast of Haishan. Are we using Carrie's teleportation again? Should I get my affairs in order? Cause that last trip took some interesting detours. I'm a teleportation professional. Remember, Carrie? Perfection! Kinda. Some effort, please! Thanks. Thanks. Thank you! What you get? The rune's guiding light? Magical girl Malorn is coming to get ya! Through these mountains is a town called Dabavin, gateway to the desert. After a stop there, we'll strike out for Imperciarch. <sighs> I wonder what the capital is like. Right, let's get going. You're with the Alliance, yes? General Cassius told us to expect you. You're free to pass. Let's keep moving. Off you 
you go then. Lady Victory blesses your fight. Thanks. Thank you. Okie doke. Do this. Sullying my blade. This magical girl just powered up. The rune's guiding light? Magical Burma War is coming to get ya! Surprising. 
By the rune's guiding light, Magical Girl Malore is coming to get ya! Challenge accepted. <laughs> Me, won't you?
Thank you. Thank you. 
this. You're finished. Does anyone need healing? I just keep getting better. Let's get it done! How is everyone feeling? I do hope you aren't too tired. Indeed. We'll seek crossing to Impertiarch in the next town. Mountains, deserts... It's all pretty exciting if you ask me. Relax, friend. We won't be making the trip on foot. Then, how are we making it, exactly? Oh, I can't tell you. That would ruin the fun. Magical girl Malore is coming 
to get ya! Opportunity to grow. Challenge accepted. Lady Victory blesses your fight. Thanks. Thank you. All right, what next? Let's head down to the harbor on the east side of town. I'm sorry, this town has a harbor? That's what I said. <laughs> now you're just messing with us.
What's over there? What the heck is that? That, my friend, is a Shi'ar craft. A desert-going vessel used by the Shi'ars. That's how they get to and from their capital. Boy, the world really is full of wonders, huh? I'm starting to understand why Lean refuses to sit still. Ahoy there, Scarlet! Got a passenger for you. He's headed to Imbershiak. Yar, that cully there. Uh, it's Noah. Me be in luck, cully. Me, Rofi's the fastest vessel on the dunes. So it's like a sand ship. Yar! What other kind there be? We Shi'arks be creatures of the desert, and Shi'ar craft are a symbol of our glory. They glide across sand faster than wind can blow. Uh, okay. Just like I told him. There are no prouder warriors anywhere than you Shi'arks. Yar, sandwalkers be living for loyalty, and we be living for glory! Are you ready to sail for Emperor Shi'ark? Yep, let's go. Oh, I'm not sure about this, but one should always swim with the tide. You sand guppies, get to work! Hoist those sails, by chum! So, what think ye of my Eurofi now? Believe how fast we're moving. I thought you could only travel like this on the water. Bite your tongue, you scurvy June rat. I'll not be getting near that wet stuff, nor have it mentioned on this ship. Wait, is, seriously? Oi! There's an old myth what says the she orcs used to live in some big. Oh, what's the word? Oshi? Shoshin? I dunno, but ain't a word of it true! <laughs> Why, just the thought of getting me dorsal fin wet makes me shudder from tip to tail! <laughs> huh. The more you know, I guess. Just go with it, Noah. Not all that sand is land. Sounds like our passengers be enjoying themselves. Give it more welly, lads. <laughs> A guy can get used to this. Enjoy the voyage? Very much so. Thank you. Now, 
Let's go see the Shi'ark in charge. Ah, the Shoalmeister? He be at the building at the center of town. Getting this done on my own. Hmm? You there! Knock knock! Who's at the door? Why, it's opportunity! Will you answer? Uh, depends on the door? Hmm, yeah, it's kinda. It's big game stuff. In fact, maybe a little too big for you. I better find someone tougher. Forget I said anything. Sorry to waste your time. Uh, any idea what that was about? None. My vote we ignore her and go talk to the Schulmeister. Can I help you, son? What's that? You need someone to whip your troops into shape? Well, you're damn right. Training matters. Fielding your troops while they're green is like handing the Reaper his scythe and saying, take a little off the top. Now, you're in good shape. I can tell that you practice what I preach. However, asking me to take the lives of your soldiers into my hands is one giant-sized ask. I won't even consider it until you've illustrated your ability to command. I propose a mock battle. You win? Challenge accepted. Good lad. Let's see what you got.
enemies seem to be retreating. Is anybody hurt? Have you be quiet? Enemy, ready your weapons. The enemy has been sighted. Prepare to attack. Now you'll see just how strong Hut Wood made me. I was a fool.
can't lose! The enemy's here! Let's get started then! My fault. No way. Sorry, Sylvie. See potential, but you aren't there yet. Train up and try again. Huh? Thank you. 
We'll be meeting with Schollmeister Skid. Oh, and Schollmeister is what the Shi'arks call their leader. The Shi'arks are fellow mercenaries I'm on good terms with, so I'm thinking Skid should at least lend us an... ear? Just be aware, we approach fighting with something of a different mindset than we do. What do you mean? War means different things to different people. And everyone's got a reason for taking lives and risking their own. For me and my kind, war is simply a way to put food on the table. And the only life we've ever known, for the most part. For the Shi'arks, though? Different. How exactly? Probably better for you to hear it from the source. Let's get inside. Guess I never really thought about it that way. So basically, you'd be wanting us to join your battle against the Empire. Yes. Duke's Aldrich is plotting a war of conquest against the League. For no reason other than to sate his ambitions. We're gathering allies to fight back. This be no wee skirmish, Cully. Sounds like any joining your side would be risking their very lives. Do you disagree, in Barnard? No, I think you have the right of it. Not that that would amount to a particularly novel situation for us mercenaries. The Sawads are already contracted to you, Chris, and may the sand swallow us if we ever break a contract. Yar. I'll admit, I didn't expect an easy yes.
course I will. Ha! I applaud your conviction, Noah. Wasn't sure you'd agree quite so readily. So, how do you expect him to do this, Skid? The Shiarcraft Race! The Shiarcraft Race! They race those things? So if we want the Shi'arks as our allies, I have to win this race? Skid didn't say anything about winning it. I think an adequately impressive performance should be enough. Let's do it! You said we could register for the race at the town square, right? to all, so dive in if your courage be fine. No experience, no problem. We'll teach ye the ropes. Show your valor with dorsal fin held high. This be the path to true Shi'art glory. Seems to be the place. Sure does. Just know that Shi'arcraft races can get pretty rough as you zip through the dunes. <sighs> Courage, Periel. This is for the Alliance. to enter the race. Hi, this be a rare sight, <laughs> but an impressive one. Uh... Oh, <laughs> no worries, Cully. I'll personally train ye into a proper Shiarcraft captain. <laughs> I be Eupharius the Seventh. But you'll be calling me coach by chum. Now, get ready and keep up. W wait. Hmm, that sound judgment from the showmeister. Just have to work ye that much harder. Ah, now then, what be your name? It's Noah, coach. <laughs> Excellent response, Noah. Our training begins now. Be ye ready. You bet I'm ready, coach. And your training starts now. 
Yes, coach. Hmm. I think this is all starting to rub off on Noah. Concludes our training. Very impressive, Cully. Thank you, Coach. Now rest up at the inn, so ye be ready for the race tomorrow. Yes, Coach. I'm ready to hustle, Coach. Hustle harder, Noah. Let's get you some rest before you collapse. Where is this inn? The Rippling Sands. Rest well, my chum. Go get yourself a good night's rest. And don't get so excited about the race you don't sleep, all right? I hear you. But I'm really fired up about it. It's gonna be so much fun! <laughs> Just take it easy, Tiger. This race is something special. Has me trembling with excitement down to the tip of me tail fin. We be having a special racer today. He sent the imps running at Ishan, and now he leads the alliance. He be the one, the only, the Noah. Go on, play to the crowd. He's going to war against the Empire, and he be asking for the help of the Shi'arks. But first, he's going to prove his valor on the sands. This race be telling us whether he's got the teeth or he's all fin. <laughs> Be it, Cully. This be what you trained for. Yes, Coach. Of course, Coach. I'm gonna hustle and win, Coach. Uh, maybe reel that enthusiasm in a bit. Just try to hit second place. That should be more than enough to impress them. Got it. If your fins be groomed and sharp, let's go! Coach! <laughs> then go give him hell! Oh, yeah!
Uh, not good. Well, I'm afraid that won't cut it. I'm sorry, guys. We came all this way, but now... Yo, don't be letting that dorsal fin sag, Cully. Father ain't in results. It be in your heart. R really? Corso! Ain't that right, Schulmeister? Aye, indeed. Though ye be losing, ye never turned your tail fin. Ain't no dishonor in that. Then, can I request a rematch? Aye, that be the spirit! Everyone, we'll be running a new race! Lift up your head and show them what you're really capable of, Noah! Got it, coach. That's the spirit! Now straighten up that dorsal fin and get out there! Yeah. Hmm. I think I did it! Yes! I must admit, I'm impressed. <laughs> spectacular, Cully! Absolutely spectacular! What a battle! And such incredible spirit, my child! Rarely have I seen a dorsal fin stand so tall. Three cheers for Noah! You ran an incredible race, Cully, and we see your valor fair and true. Then you're satisfied? I am. We Shearks would be honored to join your alliance. We'll show ye how a shoal of Shearks can chew apart even so mighty a foe as the Empire. Thank you very much. You did it, Noah. The Alliance will benefit greatly from this new partnership. And since a valorously run race deserves a prize to match, this be for you. And I have something more. The greatest gift 
we Shi'arks can bestow. Fine work, Cully. You're clearly a man worthy to be entrusted with me life. Coach? Not anymore, Cully. Just call me Eupharius. We Shi'ark stand ready to fight whenever ye be needing us. As such, we be giving ye our finest warrior and the head of our defense force, Eupharius the Seventh. And I'll be serving ye with as much sandpapery grit as I got on me own skin. <laughs> Thank you all. It'll be me pleasure to fight at your side, Noah. It's an honor to have you co- Oh, <laughs> I mean, Eupharius. So, the Alliance's castle be that way, Yar? Let's hustle! Is he gonna be okay? Looks like he intends to cross the desert by himself. Which reminds me, we should probably be heading back as well. <laughs> <laughs>